Hey yo, hey yo, hey yo, what's up? This is a beautiful Monday and it's the vibe going on the mic. Spilling the... Ah! Hmm. Stop <laughs> it, stop it. Uh-uh. Don't do that. No, no. See, we know that you have talent. You don't understand. See, you can't do all that things. No, no, but you see this rapping thing? But yeah, you should not really, really dive yeah, into I it. You did not try, my dear. Ah. Hey. May we know louder, may we know louder. Hey. It's more small. No, we don't try. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Welcome to the Afrobeat Show. It's a beautiful Monday. Mm-hmm. And yes, you're chilling with the Vibe Queen and Chi 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 Chi. Yep. Chioma. Okay, so my name is Oma Bolaval, but most people call me the Vibe Queen. And with me is. The one and only Chioma. Oh, yep. <laughs> it's not Chioma they be do. Ah, not that one, I beg you. <laughs> I don't understand which one is a beg you. Is she not a pretty, pretty dupey? Did, did I say she is not? Yeah, no, of course of um, the Emma Kobamio. <laughs> Okay, guys, how was your weekend? I mean, today's episode of the Afrobeat Show is going to be quite interesting because mm-hmm. we've got loads of amazing gist for you all. Yeah. And um, more, Twitter is on fire. Twitter is on fire. <laughs> so, guys, so I think it's better we start with this particular gist. Um, and it's because that's what is setting Twitter on fire currently. And it's between the giants of Africa. The giants of Nigeria Some and Teddy BG Presido. So, guys, recently Bonaboy dropped a track uh, titled Last Last, and he mentioned that um, it's actually one of the tracks from his upcoming album. Yes, we're expecting an album from Bonaboy. Uh, and he titled this one Love Damini and you know he dropped this last last and it's about breakfast and all of that you know how heartbreak has been served to so many people and all of that so you know there was one time David Doe just posted on his um, page his platforms that his song is currently number one on uh, all Apple music platforms and all so he posted and said that is why they call me number one hmm. okay oh well, i mean people like us that we do not who have one click or one click we love good music so we do not have a team or not <laughs> Chioma. <laughs> that's how i was on my own jj i just entered twitter <sighs> and i saw that bona boy retweeted something he retweeted you know like a screen grab of the numbering mm-hmm. and on that screen grab we saw that davido's song is now number two and is is number one yeah he just posted that screen grab and then laughed i, I think i think burner boy is really petty like, honestly <laughs> like i don't know why i don't know why he's doing what he's doing because at first we're saying okay maybe it's crucial because or maybe like because everything was like a Play, play. But now that he's like really pushing it, I, I, I'm starting to feel like there's actually something wrong. You know, you know, the other time he came out to say that there's nothing happening between him and David Do. Like, I mean, they're cool and the rest. So when he when he decided that he was going to release this particular song, um, the same day David decided he was going to release it. In my mind, I'm like, okay, maybe not Cruise or maybe. But then when he came out and then David was number one mm-hmm. and then he became number one, there was no need to go there on Twitter. No there was actually there no, was need, no need, you know. But I mean, right now he's still number one. On Ave, he's still number one, and David is already number five. But still, 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 we're still you vibing know, to are you stand strong. Shit or what? I love David. Oh. No, 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 you didn't put it out right. So let me, I'm, let me say I'm you because always, David, your fans are coming from you. The way you said it, like, no, well, no, Shia no, no, is no, still no. number one. David is now number five. That if was funny, not needed. Funny thing is, anybody Shia, that knows just me, that. let me tell you. Funny thing is, anyone that knows me knows that if you really know me. You will know that I am a, like a yeah. big fan. Shoma, because of next time, just end. Next time you just say anyway. Brother boy is still number one. Full stop. Don't say our Davido is now number what five. What I was trying to say is, no matter even if he's number five or number ten, the truth is that particular song has a meaning. And that song, great. that song, he was so intentional about that particular yeah. song. And he told us in the caption, he said he knows that he has made us dance, but this time he wants to make us feel. And we felt of every so bit before, of this. Before that so I don't, track, I don't mind if it's number 10 or number 5. So, so far, it, you know what, Choma, well. before that song dropped, yeah. David already expressed himself uh, through his captions on some of his platforms, yeah. saying that, you know, nobody gets to, or not everyone gets to see the the soft side of him people yeah. just see him as a hard guy 
So people throw things at him. Sometimes he feels unloved and all of that. Mm-hmm. But this song is about him expressing himself. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yes, he's got his low moments and all of that. But you know what? He just has to... Uh, he has to stand strong and no, then, you no. know, stand above the yeah. hatred and all of that. Okay, so Chioma, now. Now. So, let's say we just said that Bonaboy is being petty for doing some of his things. But now, Imade, Davido's first daughter, yeah. celebrated her seventh birthday recently. And Davido flew all the way from the US and went to um, Imade's party. He even organized, like, a surprise thing for her. Now, if you know David very well, you know that he's got this very strong love and affection for his kids. Children, yeah. So, um, he gifted his daughter something. Yeah. And that thing looked like... It, it, was, it was basically a toy. Uh, it had like a series of toys. Mm-hmm. And uh, it looked like a Bonaboy toy. Okay. Now, people are currently attacking David o on social media. Have you seen the pictures? A burner boy toy. Yeah. Have you seen the pictures actually? <laughs> so I didn't really understand when so I when I saw is, people dragging so the door and all of that. You can play the game actually. So, so if you feel it, like it's a clap back. No, I mean if it's a clap back. <laughs> I mean, it's David, he cannot. He cannot be wrong. Take the side. <laughs> don't say that to me. You know the funny thing? It might just be a coincidence. Because I, I really don't know. So one what thing if I this know is for sure. what Imade likes? One thing I, one thing I know for sure is Bern, David Doe doesn't have time to be petty. I feel like he's the so kind of person... it feels like a coincidence. Yeah, I, I feel so. Because I know he's the kind of person that would always like... Um, express himself, tell us how he's feeling. Remember when he granted that interview that he told us about how he doesn't feel comfortable with that burner boy and whiskey, they, he feels like they're, they're always against him. Mm-hmm. So I feel he's the kind of person that, that's why on Twitter, anything that happens, he always goes there to go and talk. Everybody will be like, why are you today talk? Why can't you be like whiskey? But that's how he, he is. So it's I don't think, very he's very expressive. So I don't think he did this to maybe be petty. I think that this was just a gift for his darling daughter. Mm-hmm. So okay. I don't think that. Okay, because um, I have like a screenshot from someone's post. This person says, Davido. Davido always sets himself up for drugs. Man's always insensitive. Later, he starts feeling defensive. What's the meaning of this? Same children you never joked with. We are watching. When the tables turn, around don't come here to rant then someone else says him love him they involve in picking which isn't so healthy another person says what if the child loves loves app toys you know thing good outside so you know the funny thing is the funny thing is i actually saw this i actually saw this picture but this story looks like no, but that's the thing. I didn't, I didn't even notice so. Because I saw this picture the day he posted it, and I didn't mm-hmm. even notice that this even looked like Burner Boy. So I don't the know. Now. The chain is even giving it out. Like, I don't know. I don't Funny think enough, so. It I might don't just think be so. like a coincidence. Yeah. But you know what? I feel that you see fans, eh? All these people, there's this TikTok video I saw on TikTok by Mei Yoko when he um, used the caption to all the fans always trying to, you know, always doing caucuses and all of that. You see these fans, then two do, you. some of you two do, where yeah. there is nothing, you guys you try guys to exactly. bring up something. I feel because like that's funny the enough, like people quarrel like. Yes, more, now, that's why, you see, fans, 90% of the beef going on between so many celebrities. They were fueled by fans, the fans yeah. bringing out, you know, even when the celebrity doesn't really see a big deal in, mm-hmm. in the matter. And then they you know, start to they, compare. They, they, yeah, they start to, they, like... they start to compare and all of that. So, you know what? Um, I know that uh, because Davido has said something like that, he has posted, he has made like a post um, about his kids. I think someone was trying to drag Ifangi, his boy from Chioma, his son. And he actually posted that, you know what? You can throw the hate on me, but don't Not come close children. to my kids. Yeah. So I don't feel that someone who said that and was being defensive about his kids, knowing the kind of hatred he even stated in his caption that is being thrown at him most times, I don't think he will purposely like drag his, his children, kids. Yeah. You know, allowing her to post with pictures like this. If that was his intention to mock Bonner boy and all of that. So guys, please, you guys should take a chill pill. Please, 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 please. please. You guys relax. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, okay, no, Bonner boy. David is not petty. Uh, He's not petty. Uh, 
Betty. We, um, speaking of the the songs that they dropped, mm-hmm. recall in, you know it's not Burner Boy that um, dropped that particular day. We also have Overdose. We have um, yes. this kid's song and exactly. the rest, which is like and we have good. White Money's song. So I, I said I was I wasn't going to mention it, but I don't know what's wrong with you. <laughs> No, you just no. have somebody said sure, if she has one more hola. <laughs> <laughs> one more hola. See white She's money. Like, hola, I hola. A, white money. I am a huge no, but fan. I love white money. I no, uh, no, no, no. But, I but. I am a huge fan of white money. I mean, <laughs> I would have thought that you know, there's an interview I had with White Money and honestly, I personally asked that question if he was going to like um, open up a restaurant. Yeah. Because I, I am going to actually patronize because, you know, the way people talk about his food in the house, I only expected that it's going to come out and then, you know, but it feels like, okay, he's channeling his energy towards yeah. music. Hmm. I saw a lot on Twitter. Some people were saying, please, let's advise white money before he spends all his, his money, money on, Twitter. on music. I mean, they used FA as an example to talk about. No, that wasn't supposed to be like a yeah, year, but like it's the truth. The, the thing is, most times they go into these things because they feel like. <laughs> Joma, no, 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 no. I'm not making this with my wife. I'm not. Now, let me tell you why I laughed. Let me tell you why I laughed. Like, I just, my head just flashed back to a particular tweet that I saw. And the person was like, ah, ah. But you know he featured, um, what's his name? Zoro. Zoro, yeah. So the person was like, <laughs> oh my God, Choma is making me laugh and I don't like it. Not- Choma, stop it. Stop I'm it. So, I'm, I'm part of the money gang and, and I don't like I don't, the fact that I, you're making I, I me do, laugh I this week. It's going to feel too. like I'm making just a white money. <laughs> I'm but I'm laughing at this tweet. But you know, you know what? You laugh. Okay, let me just tell you what the tweet is about. Okay, the person okay. said, ah, me will not like it. So we'll try it. But after the old Zoro swag, then when money was like, hola, 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 like what you're doing. Oh, Stop it. I'm just, I feel bad. I don't, <laughs> you know the so funny when, thing? I, some people said um, white money to be said is post and all of that. Yeah, he did. He I did. only hope like he, he wasn't really feeling bad. No, he wasn't. He, really posted, really he, did, tell it, no, he did tell it before he released oh, that song. Oh, he did it. Maybe yeah. he was prepared for what was I think so. <laughs> Or maybe he archived it. I don't know. No, no, but what I, I know for sure is that he, he did it before because I know that I checked his um, Instagram page mm-hmm. before that. So yeah, I know that he released a song. Mm-hmm. Um, he came out of the um, Big Brother house and he did really well and it sounded really good. So in my mind, Even I'm like, that one, people, people actually. But I think, but, but it wasn't but, as. But I think that one as, is better than uh, this one. Yes, so in my mind, I'm like, so these artists they grow. So they released their first song. It's not everybody that makes it the first time. First time, right? So, so in my mind, I'm like, he made something better. Exactly. So when he released and I'm like, hola, ah, hola, 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 This ha. might not be for you. Might just love to sing. The first sing. one was Selense. Yeah, I even mm-hmm. had like a dance step for it. Mm-hmm. Like just really cool, but mm-hmm. I don't so, think they can. So have you know, you know the funny thing is, the funny thing is, White Money is really hoping, and I pray, I join my faith with his, is hoping to win the Grammy someday, and I just I wish him well. You know what, guys? Let's go I on do. a quick break because I don't. I I am a member of the Money Gang. Honestly, I I don't like what Choma really, is making me do. Choma is laughing, and the funny thing is, Choma is also a great fan of White Money. I'm not laughing. Why are you laughing okay, now? Um, but like that's the one I'm laughing. Why right? are you laughing, Choma? So, somebody can express herself again. Why is it a whole la whole la? Guys, please let's no, go on a quick break. Not, I'm not going to allow you ridicule my White Money. When you already ridiculed him, he did I? Oh, no, white money, me, I love you. I love, I you, love too. you too. But this hula, 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 I will not lie. <laughs> I will not lie. Because when people were throwing shades, I, I, when I read the tweet, I was like, no, 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 you can't be doing this bad. to my white money. And then I listened. Ah. Um, I even listened in the office with speaker, everybody. Ah, we had to say, ah, whose song is that? Ah, I don't know. Okay, guys, let's go on a quick break. And when we come back, we're going to continue the Afrobeat gist for today on the Afrobeat show. Stay tuned, guys. We'll be right back. Make me go back. I know, like my baby. 
Still the Afrobeat show right here with your favorite girls. I'm Chioma and I'm the bike queen. <laughs> As always. <laughs> okay, guys, welcome back. Yes, of course, it's the vibe queen of Mobilabal and Chioma. Mm-hmm. And before the break, we shared with you some of the ongoing hot gist in the Afrobeat world. And Chioma and that puts me in trouble. So we went to <laughs> the quick <laughs> break. <laughs> welcome back, guys. So, guys, I'm still talking about, you know, some hot, trendy gist. Uh, let's say something more on Bonoboy before we move on to the next gist. So, um, I mentioned earlier that Bonoboy is going to be dropping um, a new album. And that's where the track Last Last is from. Yeah. That's one of the tracks from that coming album so we're looking out for the album um the album is going to be coming out sometime in june and uh, he stated that he sampled tony braxton's on love he um he samples tony braxton on love damini so love damini is the title of the un- incoming album so we're really really anticipating this one funny I thing mean, is i'm sure most people don't know his name is damini yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's his name. So I'm eager to listen to that particular. I, mm-hmm. I think there's a there's going to be a track titled "Love." Yeah, Damini. Damini. You know the name of that album. There's going to be a track like that because he mentioned that you know he sampled Tony Braxton on there. Mm-hmm. So I'm wondering if he featured her or like maybe. He, you know, used our work and all of that, yeah. featured some of our works and all of that. But, well, we're anticipating. Guys, the next gist is on A. Eh, Malians, 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 Malians. Where are the Malians in the house, please? Remember I said I do not belong to any caucus. Me, I'm a lover of good music, please. I am a lover of good music. I do not belong to anybody. And that's why I frown at people who just say, no, 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 no. We, no, no, no. Whiskey FC, don't come close. Like this um, right. 30 BG song, the song that's trending now, the one where Davido featured, um, you know, this uh, girls from Kanye's Ye. Mm-hmm. Aha. Uh-huh. So um when some people some people have been doing videos with a caption um when we skid FC strikes to jump on the trend um you know the beat skips and I'm like why can't you guys just enjoy like, this music in peace? It? You people should stop creating I mean rancor where there is none. So and even talking about that, 
please, do you know that people actually criticized um, David O's song? They were saying that why would he feature the samples? That's the name of the, 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 the choir oh, no, that he featured. But the thing is, the thing is, you always criticize your song. Exactly. I feel like this artist... Well, like, it's a one. secular song, so... Eh, I haven't you heard to... Like, I was speaking to someone this morning, and he said... Some people said... Some people, some people are saying... Um, I mean, maybe we leave, maybe we leave this church song go collect breakfast. I mean, how did they even put it again? I'm it like, they're, 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 they're making it. I think we were just trying to say that David O's song sounds like a church a song. Church song, yeah. Really? So I feel like at this point, this artist, like they are already used to it. But like, really, Chema, um, Stand Strong is a good. Is a no, good boy, song. it is. It's a good. People like, are used to uh, just <laughs> check out. Yeah, you, you people, eh? That's why you people deserve some of these things. You people are used to hola hola hola. That's right. why they give you the hola 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 hola. They give you break fast eh, boobs, too. Can you, can, you know that's what you want. But this is like it's is it's like a is like um another direction of or another um aspect of Davido. Yeah. You know, is is far away from the you know. I go love you. I go when right. an artist is giving you same tune, same message, same lyrics. You guys will complain, mm-hmm. and then now is here giving us something entirely different. I don't really think that David Do does emotional songs, but I this is like so this is like a first, and this is nice. Okay. So you guys are really still complaining. Anyway, if you don't shout like David Do. You shall like Malians, Malians. <laughs> anyway, the president of the Malian nation has spoken. So he dropped the video on his um, social media platforms where he had like uh, mics and, you know, it was backing like Nigerian flags and all of that. And then he had a message to drop to the Malians. So he said he's going to be dropping like a new track on uh, the Malians Day. So Malians Day is usually celebrated on the 30th um album an album actually not a track it's going to be dropping like an album um on the 30th of uh, may and he titles this one g t t b gttb means god's time is the best Uh so as we're celebrating malian's day we're also expecting good music album Woo! are you a fan well, oh, you're being sarcastic I, here. Well, because I, I, your cue, cue, cue. Chama, I don't understand I don't, you. I don't think, I think, number one, he's doing well for himself. Are you a fan? I, Are you I, a fan? I, I don't, I won't say I'm a fan. Uh-uh. But I mean, I feel so like So you're not Malian. 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 I, 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 I don't think so. But, oh, but Have I vibed to his songs before? I think so. You sneak in as a fan well, once in a while. <laughs> <I> <laughs> But not really there. But so I think I think over the over the years he has really done well for himself. Exactly, ah, yes. do, you, do you remember when this guy trended? Soapy. For like no, no, no yeah, the was EFC Sophie? thing. No, not even the EFC thing. His first song. Which that one? Were like, uh, what's what's the title? Ah, I can't remember. But I know he did so well um, that song. Best and now that's not his first song actually. Soapy. Soapy was quite popular. Um, I think it's Soapy. I think it's Soapy. God. Best and now. Then then yeah. best Best Yeah, I think it was. Soapy. And then I think it was there are Soapy. new ones that you'll be doing like this. Uh, I so I feel Soapy. that I feel that I like what um or maybe I'm just perceiving it to be that way. But if it is that way, if it's a conscious thing that he's doing there, it's a great one so i feel that naira mali is that kind of boss that steps back to like allow his boys shine yeah so you notice that um before the likes of Zeno and others came in um naira mali used to like drop songs well regularly and um, when he had Zinu and all, he felt like as the president, as the boss, he stepped back in yeah. it and then he was allowing the guys do the dropping because mm-hmm. Zinu has dropped tracks like huh. I think it's and so Zino is doing well. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. Zino is doing well. I, I, th- I think I really commend him for that. Sir. Mm-hmm. I think it's really cool. But but the truth is we don't actually know why he stepped back. It might not be It might that. not be that. But yeah. if it's that, it it's really cool. cool. That's well, you guys, if you've missed Naira Mali a lot, you've missed getting music from him, the good news is May Tessius is around the corner. So we're expecting the GTTB album. Hey. And he's also going to be celebrating that day with the Malians worldwide. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, do you have any other thing you want to say? So I just want to say... <laughs> Let's do something that he says. Because whenever you, you get you really mean? energetic, the other day, this is how you got energetic and collected the mic and I during recording, well. and then you were singing. No, I, so I don't even understand. Know, apart from talking, I love to sing. Ah. And- <laughs> <laughs>
And Bob has hey. experienced. And has guys, <laughs> as the person that has experienced it, I'm advising you if Choma drops a song. Eh? Rush. It will not be Hola, I'll show please, you. Please, please. It's better you even go. You see, go for Hola. Go for Hola. Again, At least we could bad. pick up. We could, no, Chama, let me talk. We could pick out the lyrics it's, from uh, no White bad. Money's song. It's we no could bad. pick Hola. And we could pick way, 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 way. Well. Chama Zono, the rap she did. What I didn't for? understand what she started with. And the beginning matters a lot. How will you retain yeah. your audience? What I know for sure is that, like we said earlier, eh. people will surely criticize you. People will talk bad about your song. But an artist, what do you do? You keep going. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> please, guys, please. Wait, stay off, Joma. Go. Please, I'm begging you. Please, guys, let's even leave form in English. Ah. Eh? Shaking saw Yoruba. Eh, Jot. Each one of us is drop on me. Emma Rao. Rasho, you are. Emma Rao, we John to real long. Kelo, Kelo, for when you just use your money to get pizza and ice cream. I Trust me, it's going to be worth it. Ah, I'll show you guys. Who produce this? Because I'm sure that there are. I have not going to the baddest. That. The baddest of the baddest. Who? Special. Ah. <laughs> Please, guys, we have to go. Because even, <laughs> even, even Spencer, there are vibes that she's <laughs> expecting to produce the song. Ha! That day was like, torture for myself. Ah, no, no, and no, 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 no. And Spencer. this lady you just said, dragged the no, mic. You so of course, said, I've have, seen Spencer said, transform the, <laughs> the talentless. <laughs> I've heard, like, if you listen to, if you listen to some of the songs Man. Spencer has worked on, you know that he's good. But you know the funny thing, I'm a thespian. I can tell when this is a talent that was, you know, that was just, you know, packaged. And I can tell when this is a talentless person <laughs> that, that was helped. I'm going to go she was. <laughs> Guys, please. Wait, let's, I think, no, I think we have to about go. his Daniel, his Daniel and Buga. Oh my gosh, like, that's the, true. The old academy, he performed there. I, you know, the funny just thing I remember before, I didn't want people to say you and this the kid Daniel. Daniel. Guys, we can't no, do more, this. We go talk um, yeah. because he's doing really well. Because he had a show recently. Yeah. That song is blown. Mm -hmm. Like that song is blown. I even saw a video on TikTok today. The guy is a Ghanaian and then he was trying to make up a comedy, um, a comic video of how the song came to be. Yeah. Like, it was like, um, it came up from a father that was trying to um, scold his son. And then, you know, it was like, kneel down. And the guy who, the guy who wanted to kneel, but it was, you know, you know how this big boy just feels like when your principal is trying to flog you, yeah. that big boy thing you do on the assembly and all of that. The video was really funny. And I just feel like, it, it, apart from Nigerians, like worldwide, the it. song is I mean, boring. I watched the video, like, not so long on his page mm -hmm. and I just had goosebumps. The fact that people were like singing to the, song, the song, and then he was, it was just so one beautiful day, one to day, see, I go really. make him for this music. Industry. We go make him. No, don't worry. I go make Do your own making. Up. I mean, in a separate way, not on my track. <laughs> okay, guys, thank you so much for tuning into this guys. episode of the Afrobeat Show. I'm sure you had fun, cause personally, I had fun. Like I, I have laughed too. away my sorrow <laughs> this morning, and I'm sure it's gonna be a great week. Um, yes. Um, I did this particular special episode with Chiyo Ma, mm -hmm. and it was really interesting to, you know, to do. Mm -hmm. So guys, uh, this um, show is proudly packaged by Creatrix Empire. Um, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel at Afrobeats Global and follow us on our social media platforms at Afrobeats Global. And guys, you can follow me on my social media platform on Instagram, omobolanli adigun underscore, on Facebook, Valentina Adigun, and then on Twitter, omobolaval. Basically, omobolaval, but you know how those social media platforms do. They've shown me baby, they've served me breakfast. That's why it's not, it's not rhyming. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you can follow Chioma too. On, yeah, on Instagram, you can follow me um, at Chixis, C H I X I Z. Then on Facebook, you can follow me. My name is Eze Chioma. Very simple. You don't have to stress it. Well, as hard as, are you trying to? You well, like to well, 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 <laughs> eh? So it's my own no, name that is hard. I'm, I'm not petty. Uh -huh. Please, guys, Jare, please, let's leave you in the hands of one beautiful musician. I mean, I'm not going to mention names. Just enjoy the music and have an amazing week. It's goodbye from Chioma and I. Bye. Bye.
Simple 